Hello guys! Today I'm going to be sharing with you how to make these super easy and very yummy pumpkin cupcakes. Let's begin! In a medium sized bowl, add 2 cups of all purpose flour, 1 heaping teaspoon of allspice, half a teaspoon of salt, and you're going to take your whisk and you're going to mix it until everything is well combined. Once you're finished mixing everything, you're going to set this bowl aside and you're going to grab a large bowl. In this bowl, add one cup of softened butter, one and a half cups of brown sugar, half a cup of granulated sugar, and you're going to take your beater and you're going to cream it until everything is light and fluffy. Next, add four eggs and one teaspoon of vanilla extract and continue mixing until everything is well combined. Once you're finished mixing, you're going to add a little bit over a half a can of pure pumpkin. Then add one teaspoon of baking soda. Then continue mixing until everything is well combined. Once you're finished mixing, you're going to add the dry ingredients into the wet ingredients. I mixed it a little bit before I turned on my handheld mixer just because I didn't want all the flour just to like blow up in my face. The liners that I'm going to be using is from Sunsella Little Gems and these are silicone baking cups. So instead of using cupcake pans, I just took my baking sheet and placed these silicone baking cups on it. And to make these cupcakes even yummier, I put some Oreos on the bottom of the silicone baking cup. Then I grabbed my handy dandy ice cream scooper and took two scoops of the dough and placed it on top of the Oreos. Bake the cupcakes at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for about 20 minutes and I allowed it to sit for 5 minutes and take a look at this cupcake. It was very easy to remove the silicone off the cupcake and take a look at this Oreo. Doesn't it look perfect? In fact, when I bit into it, I was so surprised at the crispiness of the Oreo. Usually when I bake it in a regular cupcake liner, it kind of gets soggy, but it turned out really great. If you're looking for some silicone baking cups, I will list it in the description box where you can get some. So once the cupcakes has completely cooled down, I took some cream cheese frosting and piped it onto the cupcakes. If you're looking for a recipe, I have a recipe and I will link it in the description box. To garnish, I put some pumpkins on top of the cupcakes. If you're looking for more Halloween themed desserts, I will link it in the description box. Also, if you haven't subscribed already, hit that button and you will get all of my latest recipes. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you on my next upload. Bye guys! Mm -hmm.